Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, trapezoid as you can see in this uh, diagram such that uh, these uh, parallel uh, sides are represented by x plus uh, 3 and uh, 3x uh, minus 1. And moreover, this mid segment is 15 units. And furthermore, the height of this uh, trapezoid is uh, represented by 2x uh, minus 3. Now we are going to calculate the area of this uh, yellow trapezoid. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let me make it very clear that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. Let's go over the definition of the trapezoid or sometimes we call it uh, trapezium. A quadrilateral with at least uh, one pair of uh, parallel uh, sides. And here's our next step. Uh, let's recall the trapezoid uh, mid segment uh, theorem. If we have these A and B the basis of this uh, trapezoid and C as the mid uh, segment, then this uh, mid segment uh, C could be written as uh, A plus B divided by 2. And now let's focus on our uh, this uh, diagram we can see that this uh, blue line uh, is our mid segment since this uh, bisects uh, these uh, side lengths. If I label uh, this base as an A, this base as a B and this uh, mid segment as a C where A equals to x plus 3, B equals to 3x minus 1 and c equals to 15. So let's go ahead and plug in these uh, values in this uh, formula. c in our case is uh, 15 equals to a in our case is uh, x plus uh, 3 plus uh, b in our case is uh, 3x minus uh, 1 all over 2. Now let's go ahead and combine the like terms on the right hand side. So on the left hand side we got 15 equals to we got 4x plus 2 all over 2. And now let's focus on the right hand side. This right hand side could be written as 4x divided by 2 plus 2 divided by 2 as a partial fraction. And now 4x divided by 2 is same as 2x plus 2 divided by 2 is same as 1. So therefore this right hand side could be written as 2x plus 1. So therefore let me write down 15 equals to 2x plus 1. Let's subtract 1 from both sides. This is gone. So therefore we got 2x equals to 14. Let's divide both sides by 2. So therefore our x value turns out to be 7. So we got our x value equal to 7. We are going to replace this x by 7 over here. 7 plus 3 is going to give us 10 for this base. And now let's focus on this other base. I'm going to replace x by 7 over here as well. So this is going to become 3 times 7 equals to 21. Take away 1 equals to 20. So therefore this base turns out to be 20 units. And now let's focus uh, on this uh, height uh, 2x uh, minus 3. I'm going to replace uh, this uh, x by 7 uh, as well. So 2 times 7 is going to be 14. Take away 3. That is going to give us uh, 11 as our height. So thus our height uh, turns out to be 11 units. And here's our final step. Let's go ahead and calculate the area of this uh, yellow trapezoid. And now let's recall the area of a trapezoid formula. Area equals to height times a plus b divided by 2. And in our case uh, our a value is 10, b value is 20, and our h value is 11. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula. So the area I'm going to represent it with uh, a equals to height is uh, 11 times uh, a is 10, b is uh, 20 all over 2. So let's go ahead and simplify the right hand side. So that's going to give us 11 times 30 divided by 2 which is same as 
11 times 30 divided by 2 is 15. So therefore the area of this yellow trapezoid turns out to be 165 square units. So thus the area of this yellow trapezoid turns out to be 165 square units. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.